Hey guys, it's Melly P from The Warehouse. I have a few things to show you for today, Thursday's Warehouse video tour. Thank you guys so much for all your great comments last week. It's so fun to see what you liked and what do you want to see more of. Be sure to leave a comment again this week um, so that I can draw a name for you to win a prize of P1's choosing. Uh, I believe last week's winner won a uh, Seven Gypsies Bindery Punch, so congratulations. So here is what I've got on tap for you today. Someone wanted to see the Chatterbox Artsylicious frames in alabaster, so that is this. It has five different frames, uh, uh, more of the smaller ones and then two of the larger ones. So that is that. So there's your request. Hopefully that helps. I also want to show you some new designs that just came in from Quick Cuts. This is their bracket cookie cutter. It is a 12 inch border. So love this. This is awesome. Another of their designs is the photo frame. So kind of like a negative strip. I mean, really how simple is that? You run it through your machine with some like black cardstock. It's going to instant look like it's um, negatives and then put your photos or embellishments inside. But what I love is this, they're calling it instant photo. Of course, it looks like a Polaroid. Oh, look, and you can see myself in it. And so, again, running through some cardstock, and you've got a perfect embellishment that you can use over and over again. This is one of my favorites. Also new, just in the store today, um, is new crepe paper. I forgot how much I love this collection when I saw it at CHA um, in January. I love these stamps. This is from their Little Sprout collection. I like this owl and these birds. Really, really cute. Also from their collection is, this is the Lillian collection. This is the kit that you're getting. These papers are so cute and they're all double-sided. I love the colors. It's really spring light. And you're getting um, borders, die cuts, alphabet stickers, and um, 12 double-sided sheets of paper so if you really like this collection you um, it might just make sense to just buy the collection kit instead of onesie twosies of everything look at that bird really cute and then while i was hunting around i saw this notepad from hambly and that's really what it is it's just a notepad that you could throw in your bag but what i love is when you're done then you could reuse this transparent piece and this piece of paper on your next project so that's a really fun use and if you haven't seen it yet or haven't added to it um I really like this sugar coating glitter assortment from Doodlebug. Really cute, really springy. Then you can add your own personal touch to any of your own die cuts um, and any of your other projects. And something this would look really cute on. Again, pardon if there's any shaking. This is a one man show. This is the Doodlebug Plain and Simple Flower Bouquet. So, really, this is what it's going to look like when you're done. And then you're putting it together and adding whatever you want. I know Garden Girl Shannon Tidball has done one of these before where she put like some KI Memory Softies in the middle of the flowers. It turned out really cute. It would be a great idea for um, May Day, Mother's Day, just spring in general. So they come white and you get to fix it up when you want. This would be a really cool craft to do with your kids as well. And then I want to come back down here to show you these really great value packs from me and my big ideas they come which I hadn't noticed until today in these great chipboard type boxes that when you're done using all your paper then you have no waste because you can reuse your boxes store your supplies or give it to a friend with a gift inside this is the Chester collection oh I really like that green paper so it comes in different ones that's Chester Here's one of their travel, just their paper pads, which P1 and I were looking at earlier. Has some great papers. So, and then again in these pads, you're getting um, die cuts, which I love these die cuts right here, along with your paper. So that's kind of cool. Um, okay, now we're gonna have to do a bit of walking with my trusty list. Someone also requested to see the K and Company. Uh, wild raspberry collection so this is like the 8x8 pad which is really cute great colors so see if you request things oh look at the back of that heart i will try to get it so that you can actually see so consider me your own personal shopper i'll just add that to my resume right now p1 would love that but when i was looking at this for someone i also remember how much i love the citronella collection by king company especially this page this makes me think summer 
is a balmy like 65 degrees in P-Town today, so, or a margarita, margarita summer, whatever. All right, and now we're going to go look at some K and Company, or sorry, KI Memories. This is the KI Memories line. All the papers um, have glitter or shimmer, the words. And these are all, I really like this glitter paper. So on this one, it's just like every third design is glitter. So this one is, these two aren't, this one is. I really like that one. So a lot of this is available in different themes. There's travel, there's kind of like a girl, a home. So if you haven't seen that, you might want to take a look. This is one of my favorites, which I hadn't seen until just a little while ago. So I'm needing to add that to my bucket. These warehouse walks are about as bad for me as they are for you because then I see new things that I haven't noticed and I have to add them to my bucket. All right, now I'm going to show you. The crew is restocking, so there's stuff about these I love. Whenever I was at the anniversary crop, I was using these on a project and everyone couldn't figure out what they were. This is what they are. It's like a ticket strip. You can see they're exactly 12 inches in length. And what I like to use um, is to journal on. Um, you've seen examples from Kelly Perky. I know for sure there was um, an ad running on the front page of the site for a while. But there's these, which just, you can split them up. You can use them as a whole strip. But I love these. These are from Creative Cafe, and they are on sale now. So um, please snag them up, but wait until after I have gotten all that I want. And these have scallops. So, and they come in different colors. This one's um, white and blue. You got the khaki and red. And um, this one I love is the green and the white. So, love that. I'm going to sneak past this way. Oh, past Miss Lisa who's restocking. Hello, Lisa. Hello. <laughs> We're gonna go, um, one of the things for, let me look for it, um, Bow Bunny. I wanted to show you that. If you haven't seen this, this is their eye candy brads. Um, hopefully you can see that a little bit. On the outside of their brads, they actually um, have a decorative edge. So that's kind of have like a rope edge. And then you have the smaller ones. And these are like kind of antique looking. But then they have others as well. So that's something different that Bobani offers that not the other brads have. So if you're looking for something like that, I have a basket that I keep all my decorative brads in because sometimes it's just a nice little addition. And then this I saw just when I was poking around. Um, this is from the Born to be Wild collection. It's a bunch of chipboard stickers that are really cute. See how, I mean, you're getting tons in that. This is what the backside looks like. But seriously, how cute is that? Adorable. I swear, I don't say cute and adorable near as often as whenever I'm showing you these videos. And I really like these brads from Making Memories. Whenever they do their um, like little collections, they always do cute little brads. In their Flower Patch line, they have um, little bunnies, which are really cute. These, in this case, are hearts. So each color is a different heart. And then in the black and the red, they are kind of like a heart with a heart in the inside that's cut out. So if you haven't scrapped Valentine's Day or love or anything that you need a red, pink, kind of creamish scheme for, that would be your selection. Okay, I'm looking down my list. Anything else? Um, kind of covered everything that's new and just the random things that I wanted to show you. Oh, here's something. If you've never paid attention before, these are Braddies from Doodlebug. And they really are this, that. They're brads. And they're different colors. They only come in a small package like this for a piece. But you can get them in any color that Doodlebug comes out with. So like this one is just a yellow. You can see there's the limeade. The green. The thick, like hearts that are flocked. You got hearts that are glitter. I just love these. It's a really cute embellishment idea. I was going to see if I could find any other ones. But I think I just am in the hearts and flowers section. So there's that. But anyway, um, I hope you guys found something that you liked, um, something you hadn't seen before yet. Be sure to leave me a comment over on my two-piece blog, especially if you're watching over at YouTube, and tell me what you liked the best, um, anything that you might want to see, and we'll be sure that we get you on that um, on the video for next week. So you guys take care, and have a great weekend, and we'll see you next week. Bye.